terribly sorry. I am certain she could not be far. Let us search elsewhere. Garbage. Useless. <laughs> Gooey. Sad German noises. Hmm. Mein Gott. Oof. Doctor. Maria. What do I do? So much blood. Oh. Is there anything I hear I could use? Shot claws. Is there anything here? Bandages. Oh. I wonder if you can choose not to do that. That'd be interesting. Probably. This should help stop the plan. Mm -hmm. Mistress, thank you for caring for the likes of me. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I should be most lonesome in your eyes. Please, I... It's true. I've known how you feel, mistress. I took away someone's beloved to you. Of course you would hate me. But you are very kind to show me such compassion. Maria. Maria, can you stand? Mistress? Let's get out of here together. But, mistress... I'm the same as you, Maria. I thought I couldn't live without father. But the way father thinks of us... I don't want to be a doll, so I can't live with him anymore. But you and I, we both can't live alone. So, let's go together. Even if Father's gone, I know the two of us can make it. Mistress. I shall accompany you, Mistress. <clears throat> Oof. <laughs> Maria. Apologies, Mistress. Could I have your shoulder? Okay. Hi. I'm going to I'm still looking. Oh, man. Might want to save. Too bad, like man. Hmm. Stupid and unreasonably. True. Gotta run. Is this? Oh, uh, never mind. I go again. Father, Mistress, hurry. Maria, Mistress, never mind me. Escape. No, we're leaving together. I can't go any further. You must escape alone, Mistress. If I, I'm by myself. I. It is all right. I shall not leave you alone. I will follow behind for sure. Believe me, please. Maria. <laughs> <laughs> Kicked to the coib. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. I love his crazy voice. Yeah. <laughs> it's really not the voice that I've been doing. <laughs> Can't fix that. Uh. Oh, not my job here. Splat. What? Since when are you here? Come be with us. Yeah. Found me. I am. That's enough of our game of tag, Aya. I have to keep you still, don't I? Let go. I don't want to hurt you, Aya. It's a shame. No, stop, father. I can cover your leg with a skirt easily enough, so it should be fine. I don't want this. I want to stay with you always. I love you, father. So please, please stop this. Aya. <laughs> Don't worry, Father and I will be together now, so rest in peace. I love you. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
throwing knives. Dio is standing just off screen. Father. Father. I love you. More throwing knives. Father. The, one, the fact that one's sticking out of his head a little much. Since when are you a Black Butler character now? Right. Maria. <laughs> what do you want able to walk? Isaac. Maria. Turns out being kicked in the head is actually her favorite thing. It powers her up. Father isn't moving. Father died? No, he's just sleeping. In a pool of his own blood. I apologize, mistress. I had no other choice than to protect you. Oh, this is for the best. He might be saying it. He, he, wa he wobbled. Right now. Come on, man. I think that's what you need the gems for. Mm. Oh, never mind. It's Dio who still isn't dead. I'm glad I made it. <laughs> All right. Mistress. He has now shrugged off fatal damage multiple times in order for some hitherto unforeseen character to come in from off, you know, stage right or left and and deliver to him fatal damage again so he can then fall over and they can say their piece. Is three going to be enough? Is mom and Maria and Dio all coming in for the assist going to be enough to kill this guy? Till the next time. Oh, it's Snowball. Thank you for saving us. No need for thanks. I did just what she asked. You mean my mom? Can't say no to mama. Like I said, I'm sorry for scaring you. I had no intention of harming you. Believe that at least. I understand. Mom was trying to protect me. Thank you, Mom. Dean Dio. <laughs> I want to see you her again. She wanted that too. But I don't think she wanted to be seen as she is now. That's... Whatever mom looked like, I... It's alright. She's always watching you from afar. So don't be sad. If you are, it'll only make her sad. Okay. The curse will wear off soon, so it's almost farewell. You're going away? Uh, yeah. I got a hole in my head. We're all alive now, only because of the curse. I see. But there's something I must do before I go. And that is set fire to this mansion. Why would... You can't do that. The property values. All those happy memories I have here. <laughs> this place simply cannot be left intact. It's possible someone could find it and continue your father's work. We cannot let the same tragedy happen again. Is that what Mom wanted too? Mm hmm. If that's what she wanted, then do it. Mistress, it's okay, Maria. Even if this house is gone, my memories of father and mom won't go. Mistress. Yes, that's all right. Oh yeah, there's one thing I ask of you. Do not ever forget the people who were sacrificed here. None of us had any relatives. No one looked for us or remembered us. No one knew we existed at all. It's as if our existences were erased from the world. But we did indeed live, so I don't want you to forget that. I want you to hold proof in your heart that we were here. That's the least that you can do for us. Yes, I'll never forget that. I wonder if that's what the gems are. Because normally the gems, like you get a gem for doing a dead guy side quest, you know? Mm -hmm. Technical term. Thank you. Dead guy sub story. Oh, well, this is a goodbye. Damn. By the way, I'm a firebender. I didn't tell you. Aww. Oh, he's doing the good luck charm. Goodbye, Aya. Goodbye, Aya. May you be smiled upon. Now go. Let the legend come back to life. Goodbye.
Let's go, Snowball number 47. <laughs> And the other 46 snowballs died in the blaze. Steam achievement, a charm of happiness. It is just the two of us now. Well, and Snowball. Oh, that's right. What shall we do now? I don't know. We have to find somewhere to live. But I'm sure I can't live alone. Maria... Will you come with me? Much happier tone this time. Yes, of course. Remember, in a different timeline. She asked you. Yeah. You have done so much for me, mistress. Now it's time for me to help you. Whatever awaits us, I wish to protect you all the way. Thank you. This ending is like 40 minutes longer than the other one. Damn. Let's go. Are you sure you won't watch it till the end? Yeah, it's fine. What if there's an obnoxious sequel hook of some guy's hand sticking out of the mansion? Father? Mother? Bye. Actually, I wonder where that guy is in the black coat went. I don't! I don't care! I kind of hope he's okay. I'm sure he'll be... What's, what's Snowball doing? Mm -hmm. She'll be alright, though. He's such a mysterious guy. Come on, Snowball. A book? Mistress? What is the matter? N nothing. Let's go. The mistress is very hearty. Even after that harsh experience, she walks on without shedding a tear. With the mistress beside me, I feel we can overcome anything. However, what is this uneasiness I feel? Doctor. Put that, put that one shitty PNG back up. I didn't see it enough. Zoom in onto his eyes. Man. Ogre. Humans are such utterly foolish creatures. I have seen countless many foolish humans. You're the most foolish of them all. A human mad with desire is more fearsome than any demon. I'm a demon, I guess. And I yet I adore such foolish humans. Come with me. You can come with me, you may research to your heart's content. Great, it was all for nothing. I can't remember this ending. I'm finally here. Sorry, a new character. No one knows who this place <laughs> act. I heard about this place. Drevis Clinic. Clinic? Yeah, that that must be the place. It's out in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> no one even notices it. Um, hello? Hello? Ah, a patient. Welcome. See? She's finally grown into her adult hair. They put an adult wig on a baby body, and it was really long when she was seven, and then it was medium when she was when she was a, a teenager, and now she's an adult. She's so pretty. Is she the doctor? What seems to be the problem? Yes, well... I was born rather feeble. I usually get checkups from my local doctor, but how do I say this? Uh, my family doesn't have much money, so the doctor's given up on me. That's why I came here. I heard the doctor here doesn't does checkups for free. Yes, we don't ha ask any money from our patients. Unclear how you stay operating. So, don't worry. Really? I know you don't have any, so. I can really get examined? Of course. Thank you so much. What's your name? 
I'm Jean. Jean Rooney. This is the fact that she has a an, a a unique sprite and a name and a history. I wonder if she's in another game. Maybe, Maybe also by Sen. Jean, that's a wonderful name. I'm Aya Drabus. Nice to meet you, Jean. Yeah, you too. <coughs> that doesn't sound good. We should examine you right away. Come in, come in. For someone who's not all that healthy, your legs sure carry you a long way. Was it difficult for you? I met a kind old woman on the way here who took me part part of the way by coach. It was nice. I, it was so nice of her. There are some really nice people out there. Just like you, Dr. Jervis. Oh, I'm not a doctor. <laughs> you think so? Well then, let's begin. Now, lie down here. Boy, I'm nervous. I hear horses. They don't sound far off. Are they in the back? Does she have the horses in the back? <laughs> oh, you made a horse noise. Stay very still while I apply anesthesia. Ah, yes. For a checkup? Very pretty eyes, you know. Oh, so beautiful. I'm almost getting lost in them. No, no one said that to you before. Thank you very much. <laughs> Nervous, huh? It's fine. Just relax your shoulders. Doctor? Um, doctor? Do you think you can make me better? Of course. From now on, you'll never suffer again. So don't worry. Now go to sleep. Indeed, the mistress is much like you. It does run in the family. Doctor.